Lovely. What a pleasant surprise. I was just finishing up my notes for the night. Paula, I need to tell you something. Truth is, I should have told you the other night, but I was afraid. Harvey, what's going on? Donna kissed me. What? I walked in to talk to her about Jessica getting disbarred, and before I knew it, she kissed me. Let me see if I understand this. The night you came home and asked me to move in with you, you just kissed another woman. Well, that's not what happened. Well, that's an interesting point of view because it sounds to me like that's exactly what happened. Paula, listen to me. I, I didn't invite it. I didn't do it. I, I didn't even know how to handle it. Well, let me tell you how not to handle it. Don't come home and give me some bullshit about wanting to move in with me. And when I ask if something else is going on, lie to my face. Look, you didn't ask me if something else was going on. You asked me where this was coming from, and I told you the truth. And what truth is that? You make the world go away. Right. Yeah. But what you meant was, I made you forget about your feelings for Donna. I don't have feelings for Donna. We've it's... been through this. Of course you have feelings for each other. You've worked side by side for years. I'm surprised something like this hasn't happened before. Paula, I messed up. Yeah. I should have told you the other night, and I didn't. But why can't it be that what happened made me understand that I want to be with you? Well, it can. But it doesn't sound to me like it did. That's not fair. You're punishing me for what Donna did. Harvey, that's what you're not understanding. What Donna did is far less important to me than how you treated me after she did it. I had a feeling you were up here. Well, the reason I came up here was to be alone. I get it. You had a hard week. You got blindsided by Stanley Gordon, and you also got blindsided by me. Harvey, I crossed a line. I put you in a horrible position with Paula, and if it's caused you any problems... Of course it's caused me problems. I told her what happened two days after the fact. How do you think that went over? I think she must hate me. She's not worried about you. You're not the one she's dating. No. You are. And I messed with your life. And I made you think that you couldn't trust my judgment. Never heard you say that before. I can't go back and undo what happened. And even if I could, I don't know what I'd do. But what I can do is tell you I'm sorry. Yeah, well, like I said, I'd like to be alone right now. The other night when you said that you were surprised that nothing had ever happened between me and Donna before, I should have said something, but I didn't because I was afraid. It was years ago and it was only one time, but Donna and I slept together. Say something. <laughs>